Hey everyone, Sandhill Shooter again. Um, listen, I wanted to come clean a little bit. Um, by now I'm sure some of you have uh, been very, very upset of what happened in that uh, earlier video where we met Edward. Uh, the very idea that a cat with no claws whatsoever would be allowed outside uh, to run around unsupervised and unprotected uh, should be quite appalling to anyone uh, whatsoever. Um, certainly would be appalling to me. So the truth is that's not actually the way that works. Um, it is true that Edward and his sisters have no claws. What's not true is that they go outside. Um, unless they happen to slip out the door uh, when we're not expecting it, and if that happens, we drop whatever we're doing and we go chase after the cat and get them back in the house because they can't protect themselves, therefore they can't be outside. They're not outside cats at all. And uh, I think you can understand why, because there are dangers outside in the world, other alley cats, um, dogs, other animals, cars. A lot of things can happen to a cat that can't protect itself. It can't defend itself, it can't uh, climb a tree or a telephone pole, anything like that. Um, and so we cannot allow our animals to be outside. We have to protect them ourselves, and the way we do that is we keep them inside. Um, or if they do get out, we get them right back in. And I, I hope that makes a little bit of sense. Uh, maybe sometime uh, you're talking to someone who doesn't believe that we should have firearms in order to protect ourselves. Uh, maybe you're someone yourself who feels that way. Uh, you stumbled across this video because you saw the, the cute kitten in it. Um, but uh, the cat is cute, not the guy talking. I get that. I'm, I understand. Um, but the, the fact of the matter is that Edward and, and the other cats not having any claws does not make them safer when they go out into the dangerous world. In fact, quite the opposite. It makes it, it makes it unsafe. It makes it too dangerous for them to be out there um, without us along with them, holding on to them, um, making sure that, that nothing bad happens to them. And so hopefully that, uh, that makes some sense why it is not safer for me to go out into the world unarmed because I may decide that I don't want to, to carry a firearm, but that doesn't mean that the world gets any safer. I'm not the one committing crimes with my firearms anyway. I obey the laws. And anyone who obeys the law is not a problem. They would never use their firearm uh, to, to commit any kind of a crime, to hurt someone uh, or rob someone or anything like that. Uh, they are a defensive tool, and that's why we have them. Um, but the fact of the matter is the world is dangerous. There are predators out there. There are people who choose to do bad things. And clearly the laws that we have aren't working. Uh, more laws aren't going to help. Taking away my claws and still sending me out into the world will not make me any safer. So hopefully that uh, makes some sense. Hopefully uh, you can use that uh, maybe to, to prevent a different viewpoint to someone who, who doesn't necessarily agree with us on the topic. Or like I said, if, if you're someone who doesn't agree with me, um, maybe, maybe this will at least help you understand where I'm coming from on the, on the subject. Um, if you like the video or didn't like the video, um, you want to call it clickbait, whatever you want to call it, make a, make a comment down below if you would. Um, click like or dislike. Uh, either way, let me know why you clicked it. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please uh, feel free to do so. And uh, make sure you share this with your friends. God bless you all.